What's up people, Jerome Tropicals here, welcome to today's video. Um, in today's video I'm going to be talking about a fish what I used to keep. Um, a lot of people was asking me about them, how to keep them. And also when I was selling them, they was very interested and uh, wanted to know how to keep these sort of fish. Um, it's a fish I've kept before. Um, they have been kept in this tank. Um, and We're going to be talking today about the red belly piranha. Um, I'm going to be telling you a little bit about the red belly piranha and what I think about the red belly piranhas. So I'm going to start off by the feeding of a red belly piranha. I had a group of five. Um, the problem with red belly piranhas is they're a very skittish fish. Um, I would only have to walk past the tank into another room, past the fish room, and they will go darting from one side of the tank to the other. Um, the other problem with piranhas is you don't see piranhas much. Um, I had a lot of bogwood in the tank for them. Um, I kitted the old tank out with bogwood. Um, and I just did not see them at all. Um, the things I fed them on are beef heart, prawns, cockles. Um, I eventually got them feeding really well. Um, started off feeding on prawns, um, then went on to a little bit of beef heart. Also added more seafood. But the feeding isn't what you expect. Um, they will come out and feed, but they're very skittish fish. Um, but prawns are boring to me. Um, everyone wanted to try piranhas, um, everyone said to me, John, get some piranhas. Um, so I got some piranhas and it just wasn't what I expected. They're not a pretty fish, they're a boring fish. Um, everyone makes out piranhas are really aggressive towards people. Um, uh, that is no, they're aggressive towards other fish. Um, but just the one piranha is not aggressive. A school of piranhas is aggressive, you can put... a group of five piranhas in um, and say one other fish um, and the piranhas will demolish it but if there's just one piranha in and you put a fish in the chances are nothing will be done because piranhas are a scolding fish so um, they all attack together but they are really skittish fish and I wouldn't recommend getting these fish again but I only had to get the fish to try these things out um, but this is just my story, what I think of piranhas, and I think they're boring. A boring fish, one of the most boringest fish I've ever kept. They're nothing like the fish you see in this aquarium now. The bitch are, has a stunning personality. And the um, other fish that are in this tank, there's a red tailed shark. And there's a, a spotted guy, as you can see just there. But they're not like, very good personalities, piranhas. Um, I wouldn't recommend getting them again. But I just wanted to uh, tell a little story about piranhas and what I thought because people have asked me saying they can't wait to get the piranhas and um, asking how they feed and what to expect. Uh, but if I'm going to tell you what I what to expect, expect uh, your piranhas to hide 24/7 um, behind whatever decking you have in the tank. Whether it's bogwood, you won't see them. Um, turn off the light and you will see them. Put the light on, you won't see them. I even tried dimming the light. And putting a different light in just to see if they come out. I even got the LED bar at the top, what you can see, just to have a um, coloured light on there to see if that would attract them to get them out, but it just wasn't interested at all. So um, expect your prize to be very skittish and uh, just hide all the time because I find prizes are really boring and I wouldn't recommend getting them again, especially if you're a new fish keeper because you. A lot of new fish keepers nowadays just want to get them because they've got a jaw full of teeth. Um, and it's it's one of them things you go through with being a fish keeper. You always want to keep the predatory fish. And a lot of people don't understand the needs of predatory fish. Um, such as tank size and filtration size etc. So I wouldn't recommend getting them if you're a new beginner to keeping fish. But hey guys, thanks for watching. Um, please subscribe to me, leave your comments on what you think of primes if you've kept primes before and how you got on. Um, thanks for watching guys. Catch you later. Cheers.